Hi, I'm Chris Peters, and this is episode four of our screencast series on building a social networking site using Cold Fusion on Wheels. In this episode, we'll cover redirecting users to new pages and a concept called the Flash. Okay, in this CF if block, we have the case taken care of where something went wrong with the data, but let's do a CF else for everything that went okay. First, let's redirect the user to, let's say, the, the home screen. Now that they're registered in, let's just let them into the social network. So we'll call wheels, this function called redirect to. And this takes similar parameters to what render page took. And if you remember the start form tag function, it takes a controller in action. Let's just pass it a controller of main and an action of home. And this is where our home page for the social network will reside. This time, instead of creating the main.cfc controller, let's just create the view folder. So in views, folder, main. And we'll create the action uh, view file as well. So home.cfm. Because we're not passing this any data yet, we don't have to create the controller file. Wheels will just know to go check for the main home.cfm file, and it'll just run that automatically. And here, let's uh, just put in a header, welcome to social network. So now let's try registering. This time we'll register as Homer Simpson. There we go. The redirect worked. So as you can see, we're now in main home. But it's a little disorienting to, to just land on this page after registering. Why don't we give them a message that says, hey, you're in. The problem is we don't want that to always show up here because sometimes people load this screen not after registering or actually most of the time that'll be the case. What we can use is uh, something in wheels called the flash. Basically what the flash does is it holds uh, some temporary values and it only lasts for one page load. So it's good for things like success messages, error messages, and other notifications that you want to give the user that are just temporary. So in our controller file, we'll call a function called flash insert. And this allows you to insert a key value pair. So let's insert a key of success and its value. Um, let's say you've successfully registered. Welcome. Now that we have that in there, on our home page, we can, uh, let's call CFIF, and now we can say if flash key exists, and we'll check for that success value. And then we, within that, we can call flash success. And let's wrap that in a, a P tag of class success. Let's try registering again. This time we'll register as Marge. There you go. Now that we're in there, you can see that it showed our flash message. Let's, but let's try reloading the page. So when I click reload, you'll see that the message went away and it'll be gone on all subsequent reloads. That concludes episode four of our screencast series. Visit us at cfwheels.org for more screencasts and more information about the Cold Fusion on Wheels MVC framework.